belt must be securely fastened at this time. To fasten it, set the metal tip into the buckle. Tighten by pulling on the strap so it's low and tight across your lap. To release the belt, lift the top of the buckle. Please remain seated with your seatbelt securely fastened whenever the seatbelt sign is on. Even if the sign is off, keep your seatbelt fastened in case you experience unexpected rough air. It's not that I want you here. my first quarter 2024 of my LMS courses with my company um, and we are I told you guys in another vlog that we do do this quarterly so I got some training to do so let's go ahead and start course good morning 
Good morning, guys. Um, we're on vacation. We are on vacation. It is Wednesday morning, February 7th. Um, we're going to start this vlog off. I have a dentist appointment to get this teeth clean every six months. Make sure you're getting your teeth clean. Um, yeah, so I just requested my Uber and we're going to head out to the dentist. You guys, this vlog is going to be fulfilled. Okay, I'm starting off. I'm going to the dentist. Um, of course, we're working out even on vacation, but I booked a pottery class. I'm going to a poetry show. I'm going to a ballet show by the designer Chanel. I'm going out to a family dinner. So it's super lit. I'm so excited. If you are new to my channel, go ahead and subscribe and join the family over here. Um, if you don't know, I'm an Atlanta-based flight attendant and I show you guys the ins and outs of my personal life and the shenanigans. Um, if you are a loyal subscriber, hey girl, hey. So I got my headphones on. I'm going to throw in my earrings. Hopefully I can get some footage at the dentist. Um, it's just a regular cleaning, so we should be in and out. But I'm excited. I'm excited. I feel like I've been away. Like it's been like two, three weeks. So I'm excited to vlog again. Nothing much has been going on, but I was like, I'm on vacation, girl. So you got to vlog. So let's get into the vlog, y'all. Let's get it going. Make sure you subscribe. Subscribe to the channel right now. Let's go. another day and we are all ready um today is february 8th thursday and the vlog officially starts now the shenanigans and the night out start now tonight we are going to a poetry show it is um don't mind my nails i get them done in the morning they look a mess um we're going to a poetry show. I saw this on Instagram. I saw everything on Instagram. Well, I looked the pottery class that I'm going to. I looked it up. But the fashion show by the designer Chanel, I also saw on Instagram. So don't sleep on the hashtag. So yeah, we're going to a poetry show. Um, I don't know if you guys follow um, Atlanta Poetry on Instagram, but I seen this guy posted that he's having a show in Atlanta. So we're about to head out. Um, doors, doors do open at 8. Right now it's probably 8.01 or so. Um, I wanted to get there like 8.30 because I did get a premium ticket. I don't know what exactly what that means. But the show starts at 9. And I don't want to be waiting around too long. Um, I just want to get there early enough so I can um, probably get a glass of champagne or something. And yeah. And just enjoy my night. So let's go, y'all. I'm about to uh, get my Uber and we're about to head downtown. It's downtown Atlanta. Um, at the, I'll put all the details on the screen, okay? I'm gonna show you guys my outfit before we head out. Just a little all black things. Little purse here. Got this all black shirt from J Lux Label. Got these trousers um, from J Lux Label, probably two or Fashion Nova, I don't know. Boots from. Amazon, uh, Versace watch, and wrist bracelet, okay, Versace on the wrist, and yeah, a little all black ensemble, you know, okay. I also got this purse from Amazon, y'all, um, but they wanted us to wear all black with a pop of pink, so I'm just gonna have this kind of like out here, I guess for Valentine's Day. So yeah, so we got our all black with a pop of pink, honey, just a pop. And yeah, I'm super excited with the hat. I really want to take pictures. I don't know. 
don't know if we have time, but we'll see if we have time to take pictures outside of the venue. So let's go. Um, 
I've been editing the blog so far and I'm already at like 16 minutes. So I think I'm going to split it up. I think I'm going to, cause I just got some cute stuff in the mail from Fashion Nova um, and J Lux label. And I definitely want to show y'all that too. So I'm going to have to split it up. I got some stuff coming in from Amazon too that I'm going to put in the next vlog. So I don't want it to be too long. I don't want my vlogs over 25 minutes, 30 to max. So I'm going to try to keep it down because I know some of y'all don't be watching all of the vlogs. So I'm going to try to keep it down to like 25 and then to just have more content. So we went to the poetry show last night that went really good um just to give y'all the tea it wasn't that many poets there so i was kind of bummed about that that's my grandma singing y'all don't mind her she about to walk up on me i'm an arrow salvation <laughs> God, the people were hearing you singing, girl. So, and then this is a bunny. Is it giving ghetto? Because <laughs> I'm leaving the house. Not with that bunny. Oh, did y'all catch that shade that my grandma said? I said I'm about to leave, and she was like, "I know you're not going nowhere with that bonnet on." The shade. The shade. I mean, let's talk about it. Let's talk about it, baby. <laughs> she always shaded me, but that's okay. She can't because she's grandma. That's what I was thinking, too. Um, so, the poetry show was really good last night, but they didn't have as many poets as I thought they would. Um, but it was really good. I had a really good time. Uh, the musicians that were there did really good. The poets that were there was really good. It didn't last long. Like the poets came in and did their speech and they were like knocking them out like really fast. So many performances. Um, so, but still enjoy myself. Today, I have the pottery class. So I'm trying to film as much content as possible and it's going to be very detailed and I just feel like it's going to go well over 30 minutes so I'm going to do um you guys saw last night I'm going to do the poetry class and I'm probably just going to go ahead and go to the gym I need to get a session in I try not to let two days go by and two days have been going by and as you can see your girl's neck is getting thinner okay um, but I definitely want to do like two hours on the Stairmaster if I can do at least one hour. Um, but I try to let my workouts be two hours a piece because some, you know, like to like this week you skip days. So instead of one hour a day, get those two hours in and knock your weekly goal out the way. But that's what we're doing. And then plus I got to show y'all my online shopping haul. So we're going to end the vlog after all of that and then we'll pick back up. Classy, so that's what we're doing and I'm going to show y'all when I get ready when I come back home. So let's get into today.
hey y'all okay so i am ready my uber is probably like five minutes away so i'm super excited for us tonight we are going to the pottery class like i told y'all before i don't know what i was thinking but girl it's too cold for heels and then i looked on the website um it's at pottery house studios i believe y'all they are getting dirty it's like girl why are you going down there looking all extra cute you are about to be doing pottery sweetie you're not doing a wine tasting put the heels up put the shoes on okay y'all so i just got this brown dress from fashion nova and then i'm gonna put on this is what i was talking about earlier like in the earlier clip y'all this with my michael core michael core shoes and then my brown purse it's still cute we, we still cute um but the uber is on its way so let's go because i need to clean up and go head out the house <laughs> so let's go we are here for the two hands pottery studio So here we are, turning the pages, almost to page 365 to begin with a new novel and begin with new chapters and new desires, new thoughts and new hopes. It is my prayer that during this narration of book 2024, you tell the story of deliverance, peace, substance, perseverance, love, and to find the story much different than any other. There will be unforeseen circumstances, but you will get through them. Many moments to celebrate and many moments to be proud of. Your story is narrated by you, curated by your inner energy and your actions, your drive to become and develop 365 more days to become a more well-rounded, beautiful you. This is your opportunity to begin again and if needed, move forward from novel 2023, 2024 should be the transition led with knowledge and expertise about the type of life you choose to live intertwined with the positive attitude of conquering everything. You're telling the story only you know how your story your chapters your character your reality write it down and make it plain don't go backwards move forward it's your story not theirs tell it the best way you can and enjoy the moments while you have them if i could leave you with something i'd leave you Okay guys, so we are here, we have made it. She's just finished pouring our wine and it's a will and wine. And y'all, it's a lot of wine, it's a lot of wine. And we got the water, I guess uh, we just put on our, I don't wanna talk loud because it's giving like low key, sultry, sexy night, so not to be loud. Um, but the place is really nice. The place is really nice. And we got our wheel. Let me show you our wheel. <laughs> and then she got our wine here. Like, I don't know if you guys can see it. Yeah, it's really nice. But I'm not going to talk much. Um, but enjoy the night. So let's get into it. Done that before, <laughs> um, but this is new, so I'm here to learn and have fun. Yeah, welcome in. Um, so, about the wine, um, 
So we want all of our wheels to be spinning counterclockwise. Um, if you want to give your wheel a try, I would just uh, pick up your ball of play before getting that started. Um, you'll notice that the wheel or the foot pedal works pretty similarly to a gas pedal. The further you step forward, the faster the wheel goes. The difference being, if I lift my foot, the wheel continues to spin. And then tools. We've got our needle tool. This um, little guy can be used for a number of jobs. Today in particular, um, I'll be showing y'all how to check the depth of your bases using this. This can also be used as a visual indicator. Then we've got a rubber rib. Um, so this tool, it's, uh, there are three different types of ribs, this being the most breathing because it is rubber. You can use it for a number of jobs. All of them are different colors and the different colors just indicate different shapes. But you'll notice that they all have a really curved edge. Um, this curved edge is going to be super helpful. Um, um, this curved edge is going to be super helpful in um, forming bowls or like manipulating the shape of any of your cylinders. You can also use this to compress clay um, or like flip the strap. I'm <laughs> sorry. Straighten or like flatten your walls or remove clay off your wall. And then we've got our sponge tool. So this. Um, it's going to be your best friend in terms of hydration. If you've got long fingernails, <laughs> yes, I was <laughs> going to put a few in the room. This is going to act as a barrier between you and your clay. Um, and so I'll show you how to use it once we get there. Once I feel that the clay is centered, I'm going to slowly release pressure. Um, so now you can see that this cup is no longer dancing, it's pretty much rotating on top of itself. A lot of people are like, oh, when, so I'm gonna knock this a little bit off center. So now it's wobbling just a teensy bit. This, at this point, if you're not used to looking at clay, it's kind of hard to differentiate. To have a visual indicator, I'm gonna hold the needle tool super steady and allow it to touch my puck in one spot. And then if I turn off my wheel head, I can see that my needle is only touching the clay on this side. So that means that this other side is off center. Um, so when you're checking to see if your pucks are centered, you can go ahead and use that needle tool to check it out. Now I can feel that this is on center. I'm gonna do the same test with the needle tool, hold it up against the piece. And now I can see that the ring is fully connected. Once you've got a centered puck, um, uh, we're going to go ahead and open this up. So I like to take my index finger from the base of the clay and just slide it across the top until I can feel that the clay is rotating directly under my fingertips. Once again, I'm used to finding that feeling. A good way to get there is to close your eyes and wait until you feel the clay rotating exactly under your fingertips. There's no better way to learn that because your eyes, there's really nothing to look at. Um, but there's a whole lot to feel. And so now I found center, I'm gonna apply a bit of water and push down into that center point to start opening my piece up. I don't wanna open the piece too deep. Ideally, I'm leaving about three quarters of an inch. So just go ahead and here. Don't be scared. Yeah, and then I'll just slide that really close to the center. Okay, slam it again. Yes. Is it attached? So if you can pick it up, you guys can attach. Okay. Let it out. Get mad at it. Yes. And then you're going to take your right hand opposite that hand and start squeezing the clay. Yeah, so if you feel the clay getting warm, or it's starting to look tacky underneath your hands, we're just going to add more water. So you're going to have your left Um, Honestly, same. That's why uh, having that, like, yeah, it based really well in your, your leg is going to help you a bit. So you'll be in the in my leg? Like yeah. Maybe I like to nestle it in because I have a bit more stability in there. 
let you give it a try. <laughs> Thank you. Mm -hmm. If you want something like a bowl or a wider cup, you're also going to make a wider cup. But um, after this first cup, we're going to coat it up again one more time just to get another, a better feel for the maneuver. Yeah. Okay. 